Hey guys, and welcome back to Skies of Arcadia. Let's go and sell our discoveries, and then we're going to go continue with the story for now. Uh, so we're going to head in here. I don't know how much we're going to get for these discoveries, but... Hopefully, they'll get us a decent amount of coin. Welcome to the Sailor's Guild. We pay very well for the information on discoveries. Uh, yeah. So... Let's go sell. What can we get? Ooh, Silver Moon Pit. Dude, that's worth some cash, man. Alright, not bad. Not bad at all. You found what? You must tell me where you found it. I must let the world know. That was a nice little earner. 1600 My god. Actually, whilst we're here, uh, let's have a little look on the ship. Um... The ship merchant. See if he's got anything. Because if we've got all this surplus cash, we're probably going to want to buy some uh, items from him. Alright, dude. Have you got stuff yet? Oh, hey there. How are you doing? I finally got my new shipment of parts. I'm back in business. And to celebrate, I have plenty of secondary cannons on sale. Make sure to purchase at least one before you go. Uh, I don't think we really want to buy anything like that now we only have two repair kits obviously that's not really acceptable uh because we will burn through these at a terrible rate let's go for 20 that should keep us uh, going for a while that gives us 22 that's fine um now a three inch cannon standard cannon main cannon used on valiant warships now, I don't think we want to buy this stuff, if em if memory serves, because I'm pretty sure where we're going to next has better stuff, which we can literally buy almost straight away. So, yeah, let's just go for that. Uh, we'll get the engine cover. Protects the engines from getting dirty and increases the ship's quick. And that is just more armor. So, yeah, I mean, we made some money from our discoveries, so let's get those. Uh... So we can only have three uh, items equipped at once. But that's okay, armoured. That's expensive, but you know, we've covered our costs. Right. Good, 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 good. Um, oh, repair kits. You can never have too many repair kits, guys. Like, seriously. There we go. That still leaves us with a cool 8k. So what is a secondary cannon? So what's this secondary cannon that you were talking about? Secondary cannons are cannons that you can fire for more than one round in a row. They are extremely useful. You can fire them well into the following rounds, allowing you to concentrate more firepower into specific rounds. Each individual shot may not be as strong as your main cannon, but it's always best to have a balance of everything, right? Yeah, it is, but we're not going to worry about that just yet. Right, okay. Because we should be able to buy some stuff at the next port. I mean, if failing everything, I can always come back here off camera anyway and pick up those secondary cannons. So we've got some upgrades for our ship, which is nice. We've got plenty of repair kits, because having two repair kits is pretty sucky. Not going to lie. Anywho, let's finally make ways to the next area, which is... That's the volume capital. We need to be going in like... The, this direction oh, let's go I do love this world map oh god I'd love a skies of Arcadia too or at least just maybe something like this it would be really cool wow there's nothing here but sand so this is a desert. I've heard sailors talk about them before, but this is my first time actually seeing one. Now that you mention it, I've heard sailors talking about them too. Ah, I, did you get these cinematics in the Dreamcast one? I'm not sure. They said that the, Nas uh, the Nassar deserts are so hot that if you walk around in the sun too long, your hair catches fire. Dude, I love that cinematic. Everyone carries buckets of water around with them so they can put their friend's hair out. And then... Oh, come on, Ico. You don't actually believe those crazy stories. Sometimes I wonder what goes on in that head of yours. 
Don't come crying to me when your head bursts into flames. That glass eye patch you'll wear will intensify the sun's rays and fry your brain. Oh, Ica. <laughs> I'm just kidding, Vase. It's just a story that I heard a long time ago. But I didn't really believe it either. <laughs> but you can't be too careful. Moonstones that fall from the red moon give off great deal of heat. It's, n it's too hot for most plants to survive. Because of this, the lands of Nassau have been reduced to a barren wasteland. Okay. I see. There isn't much down there besides sand and rock. The red moon crystals should be hidden somewhere in the desert, right? That's right, Vase. It's buried deep within the ancient temple of uh, Pirate. Ancient temple? I'll bet there's all kinds of treasure in there. Maybe some gold and some gems and magic stuff and nice clothes and, uh, and stuff. If we find a bunch of treasure, we'll be rich. We can go buy whatever we want. What's the first thing you'd buy, Fina? You'd buy? Um, well, what does that mean exactly? What? Fina, you don't know what that means? I am terribly sorry. I've never seen the rest of the world before. and You don't need to look very far to find a shop. Everybody buys stuff. It's... Uh, it's normal. Well, Fina, you really don't get out much, do you? <laughs> well, that landed with a with a thud. According to the map, there's a city nearby called uh, Marambra. Let's go there first. I'm too old for this. Okay. Now, there's a discovery to be made here somewhere. So there's the city that we need to go to, but I'm sure somewhere around here, there is a discovery. Ah, there we go. You found the topple rock. Excellent. Topple rock, a natural formation of three round rocks stacked on top of each other and perfectly balanced. The balance seems delicate, especially when the rocks sway in the wind, but for some reason, they have never toppled. Exactly. So. That's the topple rocks done. God, there's so many bits of paper here, guys. I've, I've got about 12 different lists here. Uh, we don't need to look at that one for a while. Discoveries is the one we've just done. Uh, the topple rocks, yes. Topple rocks. Now, legends have it that somewhere I have a marker. There we go. So Topple Rocks has been completed. Now, now head east from Mambra, and there is another one to find. So east. Now where was Mambra? Oh, hello. Combat. What do we have? Are these new. Oh, they are new. Oh, let's fight these things. A la... Lapulion. Well, I mean... I could just straight up killed it with a counter-attack. Yes, call your allies, fool. Aw, oh, man. Could have used, uh... Some combat. Oh, she's been silenced, I believe. Well, that's fine. Okay, these things are actually doing quite a bit more damage to us. I might actually grind, do some grinding after this video. Not much. I say that, but I'll probably do quite a bit. Because we do need to start buffing out our characters. Oh, nice. It's a shame you didn't crit the right one, Drachma, but we'll let it slide for now. Oof, nice. get a crit. Oh god, Fina's down. Oh man, Fina's so weak. And unfortunately it's Fina that we really need to start buffing up. Because my god, she's a bit on the useless side. And now we're silenced. 
Yeah, I would say that's probably one criticism that I do have with this game. If if I did have one about the combat system, it's that it's just too slow. It needs to be sped up. Shame you can't fast forward it, really. I mean, I guess technically with an emulator you could. I don't know if you can fast forward on Dolphin, actually. I guess you probably can. Right. Not a bad amount of XP, to be honest. Yeah, that wasn't bad at all. Unfortunately, Fina has taken the big nap. So let's get her sorted. Man, look at Drachma. He's got so much health. Crazy. Okay, cool. Uh, now. Where was... Ah, there it is. So we want to head east from here. Which is this way, apparently. Ah, hello. That's what we're looking for. You have found the Wandering Lake. Excellent. Why is that not actually here? Huh. I mean, it's there. Oh, wait a minute. Something's gone wrong with my guide, because we go up to number five. And then it goes to 9. 19. Oh dear. There are missing... There's missing pieces. Missing pages. Well that's... Strange. So, we found the Wandering Lake, anyway. Just before the Oasis discovery. Okay, so anyway, we've got the Wandering Lake, so that's cool. The truth behind the story of the disappearing lake is even stranger. Temporary differences make a large bowl of rock float above the desert sands, holding a lake of clear water. Once the water cools off, it settles downward again. Ah. So let's see if there's anything up here. I wouldn't be surprised. There's going to be stuff everywhere. Right. Let's skip this one ahead. Hey, level 7. Not bad. But she needs to go much higher than that. Hey, we got a, a Behemoth's Ring. Let's see what that does. See if that's any good to Fina. Is it anything right now, really, that we can give her to buff her up just a little bit? Uh, of course, that's not where we do it. Uh, equipment. Silver Veil. I mean, she gets a bit more defense, but she loses out on pretty much everything else, so it's not really worth it. Alright. Ah! We have found the Sand Force. Well, I mean, <laughs> that's also apparently not here on my list. It's really strange. Long ago, a young black pirate searched the desert for the isle that spouts treasure. After a long trek, he was shocked to find that it produced only sand. But he realized that the desert was the true treasure, and he spent the rest of his years in Nassar. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Well, you know, we're getting a lot of discoveries, so there's that. But we need to be heading east. Looks like we've got some kind of... Oh, who's that? Who is that indeed? Well, we're not going to see who that is because we have fighting to be done. getting some decent XP again nice that's what we like to see okay so this dude ah he's actually an enemy we'll try it no guarantees Ooh. 
Ooh, this thing looks serious. Black Pirates, so you're the Blue Rogue Vase that everyone's been talking about around these parts. Yeah, <laughs> we'll teach you a thing or two. Uh, this could be bad, I say. Um, let's just focus. 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 Let's try and build up as much spirit power as we can. And then hopefully send this dog back to the ground. Wow. That hurts. That really hurts. But as long as we can get a good shot with our primary weapon, we should be okay. But this guy. Oh, black torpedo. That could be nasty. Pretty sure torpedoes land like a couple of turns afterwards. And they inflict some serious damage, if I remember correctly. Oh, he's charging focus too. Which is curious. Alright, we've got plenty anyway to use our primary weapon. So, if we can get just one good shot at this motherfucker. Oh, okay, that hurt. That really rang our bell. But it's okay, it's all good. The enemy ship's approaching, they're getting too close. We're right in range of their cannons, phase. Uh, right, let's increase distance. Hard turn, get some distance between us. We'll need more room if we want to fire the S-cannon. Aye, aye, we'll show these black pirates a thing or two then. Excellent. Right, unfortunately, as good as that was, we still apparently can't use the S-cannon, which kind of sucks. So let's go for an item, let's grab a repair kit. How much? Right, let's put the repair kit there. Can we find out how much a repair kit actually heals? We can. 4,000 health. So it's not actually that bad. Wave bomb. Special bomb with blue moonstone dust mixed into the gunpowder. Alright. Okay, so what we will also do... Let's attack with the main cannon. Attack with the main cannon there. And we'll go with the main cannon there as well. Let's try and dish out some damage. Oh, he doesn't like that. He's not like that at all. But he's still pulling in his focus. But that's okay. We should be able to pretty much waste him this turn. 4,000 health returned. Yeah. Evasive action. That's not great. Oh, he's still connected. Still connected. That's all that counts. Put around straight through the bastard. Black cannon. Ooh. Don't like the sound of that black cannon. Main cannon lost. Son of a bitch. Still doing a lot of focus, which is curious. Like jousting the bastard. How's it looking now? Oh, God, we still can't use our primary gun yet. Main cannon. Main cannon. And I th think we will guard and guard. In fact, the next shot should bring him down. Black torpedo away. Shouldn't matter too much. So we should be able to bring him out. Bring him down. Black cannon lost. Good. He's trying to use his primary cannon, but he can't. Oh, son of a bitch. Yeah, as cinematic and as cool as these battles are. Oh, there goes the torpedo. They do go on for too long. Right, well, hopefully that should give us a bit of an edge. 
but you can see how it's quite difficult to rely on your main weapon sometimes. Sometimes you get plenty of opportunity to use it, and other times you just don't, which is a shame. Oof, that hurt, but it's okay. Okay. So, we still don't have an opportunity to use it. You know what? Fuck it. Just take this guy out. Seriously, just take this guy out. He's gone. Get out of here. Not bad. Not bad. Okay. Alright, let's continue on anyway. So, this is another discovery here. Go grab this. Well, apparently, you're not allowed to grab it. Nope, there we go. You have found the temple of uh, Py Pyin? Pyin? A stone building thought to have been created by an ancient dynasty. Uh, the stonework and construction demonstrate a high level of technology for that period, but no clues are left to point that point to the purpose behind these huge creations. Baze, that's it. This is where the Red Moon Crystal is buried. Great, let's land the ship and search the place right away. Wait, boy. Head to town first. I've got some things that I need to take care of. There's a port city named uh, Marambra near here. Go there first, got it? Uh, sure, no problem. I just thought we could... Uh, never mind. It doesn't matter to me. <laughs> Alright, come on. Stop fucking around. Let's go back to port. I'm sure there was other things to discover here, though. Well, more combat. Right. Fact, we may actually have replaced a lot of that gold. Cura, excellent. Anything down and around here? Doesn't look like it, unfortunately. Nope. We got nothing. So that's where that is. Okay. Let's head back to the main city. Hopefully we can get there before a uh, battle happens. I guess not. Not bad. Yes. Nice. Keep that going. And ranked up as well. Noxus. Hey, and revered voice. Okay. Right, let's get out of here. Let's go see what the town has to offer. Yeah, I'm going to have to get a better um, discovery guide, I think. Well, this place certainly looks different. So, this is Maramba. I'm sure that's it. Maramba. Maramba, that's it. So this is Maramba. It's so hot. Huh? Where'd the cam go? Uh. Hey! Wait, cam, where are you going? This is where we part company. I've got my own quest to worry about. I've got to find Raknam. Wait, wait, wait a second. Son of a bitch. What are we supposed to do? We're in the middle of a desert without a ship. How are we supposed to continue on our mission? That's not my concern. I have no interest in crystals or temples. I must find Raknam. I cannot waste any more time babysitting. You bastard. Hey, come back here, you eye patch wearing freak, you rusty old man. Hey, you listening to me? Uh, I, 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 okay, he's gone. They're screaming and shouting at nobody. Oh my, this isn't good at all. What should we do? We can't even get out of the city, let alone make it to the temple. We're stuck here. Well, we have no choice right now other than to start exploring the city. Maybe we can find someone that can take us to the temple. Yeah, we need a ship. That's all we can do for now. God, what a dick. Drachma has left the party. 
crusty old man. Son of a bitch. Ugh, well I guess for now all we can do is save. God, what a penis. Well, we don't need this one anymore. We don't have to worry about bounties. Um, now, there's a lot of chests and things to find here. I think there's seven chests here, something like that. Let's have a little squiz around. Ooh, look at this. This looks promising. So, let's go... Oh, I didn't think we could find any more of those. The moonfish was caught. Okay. Okay, now I've got my papers in order. We should be good. Now, let's have a little look, see what we've got here. Is this the inn? I don't think so. Some kind of... something. Hello? Guildmaster? Ah, this is the Sailor's Guild. Interesting. Well, let's uh, sell some information, shall we? Uh, not bad, I guess. Yes, I've heard rumors of existence. I'll pay for the information of its location. You found what? Yeah, he's quite excited about these. Right, not bad. Now, can we buy information? No. Apparently we can't. Alright, what about the wanted list? Okay, so we still have Rupee. That's fine. We can handle Rupee another time. Now, who are you? Ah, ship parts merchant. Well, uh, well, we don't even have our own ship right now. <laughs> well, that's very unfortunate. I wish to show you my newest weapon called a <gasps> torpedo. You can even set which round it will strike. It is the perfect for concentrating as much firepower on to a short period of time. Yeah, well, cool story, bro, but we can't use it. Okay. God, what a dick. I don't think there's anything around here. No. Definitely nothing there. Alright, well, let's get into town, shall we? Seems like the right thing to do. Wow, look at this place. This place is cool. I like the music here, too. Ooh, dude, hello. Is this the inn? Look at these little fans they've got going on here. Who are you? Welcome to the oasis of the desert. It is 120 gold a night. Yeah, sure, we'll stay. Thank you, sleep well. Thank you. Well, that's nice. Fair, uh, blah, blah, blah. Farewell. May the red moon be with you. Thank you. Right now, to get a cham, I think we need to go upstairs to the second floor. Maybe. Ah, here we go. Eat, eat, eat. You received a cham. Excelente. So, that's another cham down. Second story of the inn. Done and freaking done, son. That's all the chams. Now, our first chest is here. You received the magic droplets. Excellent. So that's that one. Magic droplets are always good. Now, this inn does look fancy. Not gonna lie. Now. There's quite a few chests to find around here, to be honest. So... Let's keep exploring for now. What else do we have? Hey, dude. Welcome, travellers, to the beautiful and ever-warm lands of Nassar. Enjoy, uh, Marambra, the oasis of the desert. And fear not whilst you're here. The red moon watches over all of us and the lands of Nassar. Thank you. Uh, thanks, I feel welcome already. The warmth of the moon warms our hearts here. And so I wish only to share with you that which I have been blessed with myself. Yeah, yeah, whatever, dude. All right, dude, stop. 
That's enough. Jesus. So. This guy's not even going to talk to me. There we go. Welcome. This is the best weapon shop under the moons. I offer goods from both the Valuan and uh, Nasri and armed forces. Alright. Let's see what you've got, dude. Interesting. Now, we can get that for free. Oh, no. It's not that, actually. It's something else. Something that sounds similar. So, we will leave this for now. Ten years ago, when my father was still with us and running the store, a war broke out with Valua. To keep them from being destroyed in the war, my father hid our merchandise and family treasures in the city sewer system. But the sewer system is a complicated maze. When my father went back to retrieve our things after the war, he could not remember where everything was hidden. After searching for weeks, he gave up. I wonder if it's all still down there. Maybe. Maybe you should have a look at some point. <clears throat> Maybe, dude. Maybe. So, we need to get up there. Oh. Sounds like there's another moonfish around here somewhere. Where is that? Oh. Oh. Somehow we can actually use this dude. Can't remember how. Ah, wait. Hang on. Young maiden, in the desert, water is life. That is why we must carry water every day from the well. There is a well in the other part of the city, but it's been dry for a long time now. Well, that's no good. Can I speak to you, my friend? This must be a feeding station for the Dabu. Man, what do they feed them? It stinks over here. I don't know, my friend. I don't know. Still, let's go see if I can uh, use your Dabu. Trainer, welcome, friend. Are you planning on crossing to the other part of the city? Perhaps you wish to ride a Dabu. The sands of the desert are too hot to walk upon. It's best to take a Dabu. Sure, we'll take one. Dabu stands are marked with red poles. You can dismount from your Dabu wherever you see those red poles. Okay, dude. Sounds good. Yeah, so we can ride this guy, like, pretty much wherever we want, which is quite cool. So whenever you see these, we can just park up and have a bit of a wonder. Which actually is quite a cool, nice little touch, if you ask me. Now, we didn't actually have to pay for this guy, which I'm quite surprised about. You know what these tight wads are like. Now let's go get this chest. And we should be able to get a moonfish as well, I think. So we've got the silver box, which is cool. Definitely take that. And... If I was a moonfish, there I would be, apparently. Come on. Now, where do we have to stand? There we go. As I say, it's always awkward as hell getting exactly the right little area. Apparently, the moonfish was caught. Brilliant. So, that's all of the moonfish from this area. Nice. We've got all the chams as well. So we're just looking for the chests. Right. Cool. Now let's go get some more chests. Let's go, Dabu. Uh, Dabu? Dabu with the big butt struggles to get past trees, apparently. This is quite cool. I like the whole idea of this. Hey, naked man. Village Elder. And one, and two, and three, and one, and two. Okay. Welcome, traveler. Here, here, young desert traveler. Stay a moment and listen to what I have to tell you. Uh, sure. I have spent more than half of my lifetime at war with Valua. Uh-huh. The Nasultan, our, ki Nasultan, our king, 
charged me with leading his fleet in an attack on the Volyan mainland. But those yellow-bellied Volyans hid within their grand fortress and refused to come out. That's why I'm working out, so that one day I can break through the gate of the grand fortress myself. Uh... So you're insane. Got ya. Got ya. Well, oh, You receive... Ah, the combat mail. Right, this is what I th was thinking of, actually. I thought... I'm guessing Vase will wear the combat mail. I'm not 100% sure how good it is. It's got to be better than what we're wearing right now. Heavy armor. Combat mail. Oh, yes. Yes, it is. Oh, that's the flame mantle. Ooh. Lightweight fabric. Flame mantle. Adr well, it's a dress, so... Might not be for... Vi oh. Only Drachman and Vase can wear that. So, that has more defense. So, everyone can wear the Nassar Combat Mail. So, what I might do then... Well, if Vase wears the Flame Mantle... And then maybe... Get Ica. Well, do we want Ica to wear it, actually? She's got the Valiant uniform on. But, uh, it might, we might be better off. Because Ica's got better stats than Fina. Yeah, it doesn't put her up by much. Actually, really doesn't put her up by much. It gives her, it gives every, I mean, her defense goes up quite significantly. And her, um, UW, which, whatever the hell that is. Uh. Yeah. Doesn't seem to be that perfect, actually. Not that good. I might upgrade. Let's give it to Ica. Yeah, because that puts her defense up humongously. And her will, is that maybe? Could be her will. Anna. Yeah, that does wonders for Ica. Okay. Now, what about Fina? Can Fina wear... Ah, oh, she... Okay. Yeah, she can't wear that. Right, fine. Still, that's better than nothing. So, we have the Nassar Combat Mail. Uh... Now... I think what we should do, really, looking at the time, is probably end the video. Because we do have a few little things left to collect. But we're also out of time. So, let's go have a rest and save it at the end. We've done quite well. But there's still more to find. For some reason, I had it in my head that I thought we could just ride that guy. I guess not. So we got some new armor. We'll sort our weapons out in the next part. See if we can get some nicer weapons. Should be able to. But anyway, guys, that's going to have to wait until next time. So thank you very much for watching. And as always, until next time.